What's poppin' YouTube and welcome back to another episode of Caddy TV. And yes, today we're talking about the New York Jets, one of the most surprising teams in the NFL this season. But it's not the old Jets, it's the new Jets. And coming up in this video, I'll be explaining why they're the next upcoming team to break out. Who would have thought in 2022 the New York Jets will be third in the AFC with a 4-2 record? Not even me, but a lot of thanks go to their standout rookie corner and Sauce Gardner who is truly a generational talent. But it's so crazy to see a rookie this shut down and this locked in so early in his career. He's only been playing in the NFL for six games, but he's already starting to look like a veteran. His technique, his footwork, and his ball hawking ability to go get the ball for his team is very beneficial. Now it's not only Sauce, but the Jets have a very elite defense this year. They're playing on all levels of the field, including Quentin Williams, who is playing week to week as one of the most dominant pass rushers in the league. He's even being compared to Aaron Donald. That's crazy. This young in his career, he's starting to see the flashes that we saw at college. With the pickup of Jermaine Johnson for the edge and Garrett Wilson for your offense, and let's not forget DJ Reed, who has been amazing in coverage this year, also playing like a top 10 corner. And the Jets special teams is even playing good. So the sky is the limit for this team. If they can keep improving week by week, they'll be fine. Now that Zach Wilson is back, this offense is getting better each and every single week. He is doing the things that you need to do in order to win games. But I'm seeing a lot of this offensive coordinator putting him in good positions. Last year, it was a struggling O-line, not a lot of weapons, you didn't have any running games, so you weren't helping Zach Wilson. But the mergers of Brees Hall, Elijah Moore, Garrett Wilson, and all these different types of weapons is allowing Zach Wilson to spread the ball downfield. And I really believe he's a franchise quarterback, and I hope it pans out because this kid is so special. I've definitely seen a huge jump from year one to year two. And it's not just by the stats, it's by the eye test. We've seen Zach Wilson do the easy things. He struggled that last year, making easy throws, reading the defenses, and he's doing all of that perfect. So if he can continue to build, he'll be a very special quarterback in the NFL. And it's not just Zach Wilson. Let's talk about Brees Hall, who has been one of the most dominant running backs in the NFL this year. Yes, let's not forget, he is still a rookie. And he's still almost averaging five yards per carry. That is very dominant for a young player. And if the Jets can continue to build that offensive line, continue to go out and win games at a high level, this team will be very special because they have the talent on offense and defense to get through it all. 